Henry Clay Frick was the most diabolical man in American history. Frick was Carnegie's right-hand man and was ruthless, evil, and just a downright jerk. He ordered the dam at Johnstown to be lowered so his carriage could get across, which caused it to break, resulting in the single most loss of life in American history, with the exception of 9-11. Also, for the Homestead strike, he ordered Pinkerton's army to come and put down the strike, which actually failed. Henry Clay Frick was indeed the most diabolical man in American history. We're on strike. It's all top. Uh, Henry Clay Frick sucks. He thinks he can stop uh, us. He can't stop us. We do good. Mr. Pinkerton, we need you and your army to crush down this revolt. This strike is getting out of hand. It won't be cheap. Oh, don't worry. I have the money. Okay, we'll do it. Mikey, we lost. Why did we lose? Just blame it on the rain. Blame it on the rain that was falling. What? The Pinkertons failed? What are we going to do now? Who are you guys? Mr. What Frick. do you want? I'm Alexander Burton. Oh. oh, I need to get to the hospital. Mr. Carnegie. I'm sorry for everything that's happened. It's not my fault. I've done everything I could. You disgraced Carnegie Steel. You're fired. Mr. Bergman, Henry Clay Frick is dead. How do you feel about this? I'm glad God deported him from this country before I was deported. 